Hi, this is Sai Morton with the daily update on Eurofix. I post my exclusive market overviews with the key political and economical events, charts and important levels on the forex pisami.com forums weekly. This short video is a response to rapidly changing situation on the currency markets and should help you to stand top of the game and be profitable. I suggest you to visit forexpisami.com forum and read my analysis for the week before watching this daily video. Let's take a look on the gold market as usual. So um, last week, market hasn't shown any significant action. So if we'll take a look at the weekly chart. It's, we'll see that the uh, previous week was inside one. And currently, the major changes stand only on the intraday charts. On the intraday, on the daily. Um, so currently, based on our analysis, uh, with a more or less precision, we could talk about 12.30 target. That's next destination point. Also, um, we see as the crucial level the 12.10 area because there it will be some decisive moment for the gold because if market will break through the 12.10, it could lead to the further collapse and, and action below 12 even, even to the uh, 11.50 maybe. So it will be very important. While market will stand above the 12.10, it keeps chance on the reversal, although currently it's very difficult to foresee what really uh, – factors could lead to this reversal, what fundamental background could happen. Because if you will uh, take a look at the market right now, investors mostly have some careful uh, attitude to gold market. Um, mostly mostly uh, they fear, uh, fear uh, tell that um, there's a lot of different assets that bring better return compared to the gold market. And from that standpoint, gold market will stand under pressure. Uh, but uh, and, and this position uh, was held in the market within the previous two or three months, probably. Uh, that, but that's just a – we could take a look at the storages of the SPDR fund, and you will not see any significant drop there. So the storage stands approximately around – 850, 840 tons, and despite the significant volatility till this, since, since the September, when the market drops to the 1250 area for the three times, the strategy is approximately stands at the same level. So it means that investors are not hurry to sell off their positions in the physical gold, and that also uh, means something. Either that 1250 area is not really uh, decisive area yet, so it's treated as the normal retracement. Or maybe they expect something that could change the situation on the gold market. And indeed, uh, for example, if we will take a look at the Fed policy, before the Fed meeting, everybody expects that there will be some hawkish comments and that Fed will say something really on about aggressive policy. But in reality, yes, we've got the rate increase, but uh, they, they have – they didn't add something that really makes their comments more higher than it was previously. And that's a bit softer position compared to what have been expected, and that have provided some support to the gold market as well. That's why in the longer-term perspective, guys, it's a bit difficult to judge about this because situation really could change, and uh, it's better to follow the step-by-step -step action, the minor steps that you see clearly and uh, the chances of the reaching this potential uh, target are significant. And that's why here um, we mostly will talk on perspective of 1230 target. Why the 1230? Because uh, this is actually this 1618 extension of the bottom line. This market hasn't quite reached for a few bucks here. Uh, and But probably it, it should be reached because the thrusting action here was real, really strong. So as you can see, acceleration down and butterfly shows acceleration that's usually leads to reaching on the 1618 and second reason inside of the butterfly we have the a b c top pattern and its final 1618 extended objective point xop stands also in this area this also hasn't been quite reached this preliminary upward retracement before reaching target is very typical for the gold so we have seen it million of times already on the gold market, when the market just prior to the reaching of the target for a few uh, dollars shows some artificial reversal and when some traders who are taking the long position will be involved in this trade, 
Smart returns are back down and drop to hit these targets. That's very typical action for the gold. In upward action, we mostly have talked about the retesting of this support area. This was triangle, but also this previous low stands around 1260. And take a look, mostly this has been done. So market has retested this area. It's broken consolidation previously. Now, uh, what we'll be watching for on the daily chart. On the daily, guys, um, the most interesting moment that could happen on Monday is the appearing of the bull, uh, bearish grubber. So on Friday, we haven't got it with this spike, but on the next session, to, on, uh, on uh, tomorrow, on Monday, market will, will stand closer to the MACD predictor line, and if it will test it and start to move down, that could become the bearish grubber. If we will get it, this will be a really very important for us because it will provide more confidence in downward action and will increase chance on taking out of these lows and consequently hit, hit this target. This will be the moment that we are, need to keep an eye on uh, on the daily chart. On the intraday charts, guys, uh, here what we have, our market has tested our confidence resistance that we have talked about, 1260, 1261. Here we have minor grabber, guys, uh, on the follow time frame chart. Well, it will not change the situation significantly because the chances that it will lead to the further significant appreciation on the market stands not very significant. Mostly because we haven't completed the target. If we wouldn't, if we uh, wouldn't have it, and market already uh, would complete this target in this point. Well, in this case, I would say that yes, this cover could be important. Market could continue move higher. But in current combination of the strong resistance and having the uncompleted target below these lows, chances to succeed with this grabber is not real significant. But if even if it, it will lead to some spike above this top, this will not situation real significantly. So uh, that's why I think that we need to start to watch for possible bearish reversal patterns on the intraday chart, on the hourly chart, and searching chance to get to be involved in the downward action right to the 12:30 target. Uh, one of the target, uh, one of the patterns that could be formed stands on the hourly chart. So take a look that this upward action was actually uh, finalized by the butterflies, pretty nice pattern. But very often butterflies takes the part in a larger head and shoulders. This very often happens. So here is one of the patterns that could be formed. I just, as you can see, uh, indicatively have put it on the chart just to show you how it could look like. Uh, scalp traders also could find some additional um, setups for trading. For example, what we could get. Uh, here, if market will show some minor upper retracement, deeper, some kind of the ABC action, that could become got to triple to sell. That will later lead us to neck, neckline. Some kind of the ABCD pattern could be formed here. That's one step for the scalp traders. Second setup could appear at point of the right shoulder stop. So very often, upper action also could take the shape of the ABCD. And very often, the second part of the hand shoulders become, becomes uh, the guarded chip to sell. It lets us to take the short position right at the top of the right shoulder. That's two patterns that to watch for. So that being said, our trading plan uh, stands in a certain chance to go short uh, in the nearest future in the gold market because we have a uh, good combination, uncompleted target on the daily and strong resistance on the four hour time frame chart. And for that purpose, we will be watching for two moments. First of all, on the daily, we are watching for bearish grammar. It could be formed on Monday. Second, here we are watching for a clear bearish reversal pattern, whatever it will be. Whether it will be hand shoulders, maybe we will even uh, get the Guard the to sell here. This will let us to for uh, anticipate the appearing of the hand shoulders taking the position right here. And scalp traders also could watch for some other patients. So that's the short-term trading plan for the gold market in the coming week.